episode of our new series, Ruth Bell starts becoming insecure upon hearing gossip among other girls also liking Aaron, which is her boyfriend. Ruth Bell also learns about the seven beauty queens of school from her little brother Dwayne. With so many pretty girls liking Aaron, Ruth Bell suspects Aaron is cheating on her. So make sure you watch to the end and give this video a like. Enjoy! We're going to get into an accident real soon if you're driving this fast. Please don't do this to me. I still have a lot of stuff I still want to do. Ah, Dwayne, stop whining. Hold on tight. I just got my driving license and I think I'm getting the hang of it. It's kind of fun. Maybe you can reach school in one minute. Ah, oh my gosh, someone save me from this nightmare. <laughs> me? with me when I'm driving. Hmm. Uh, I think I want to vomit. Uh, by the way, Ruth Bell, uh, Dad told me that our Auntie Karen and Cousin Potato will be coming back from Europe soon. And we'll be attending our high school together very, very soon. Really, Dwayne? I'm so excited! Do you know when it's gonna be? Uh, I'm not too sure, actually. <laughs> what the Levi? How the Levi did you guys arrive at school faster than me? <laughs> well, did you get lost, Stepsis? <laughs> Anyways, please don't be seen with me in school because it's embarrassing and being related to such two goody nerds it's gonna be so embarrassing. I'm gonna fix my makeup and go to class. Maybe cute guys will be waiting for me there today. Hee <laughs> hee. I'm gonna get so many days this year and they're gonna treat me to a lot of Gucci bags. I'm gonna buy that money. <laughs> okay, see you guys later. A princess has to arrive first. <laughs> a ta, ta losers. Wow, I can't believe Stussy is so rude. Right, sis? Uh, well, she's always like that. My name is Manon Ramos, a Filipino girl boss. I'm a smart, strong girl that you shoot and cross. Yeah, I'm finally here. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh, Mama! Oh, you're such a girl boss. You have an electric bike? It's not a big deal, honestly. Come on. Let's get to class before the principal comes. Hmm? <laughs> hey, Dwayne, let's go to class this way and let your big sister go chat with her boyfriend before class. <laughs> uh, 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 oh, okay, sure. <laughs> All right, sis, uh, the bell rang, so we gotta go to class. Have fun, bye bye. <laughs> See you later, Belly. <laughs> Have fun with your boyfriend. Uh, 
Huh? What are you talking about? Why are you acting so strange all of a sudden? Hmm. Well, time for me to head to class. <laughs> And you look so hot today. No wonder I'm sweating right now because it's of Aaron's hotness. Am I right? The sun is so hot. Just like Aaron. <laughs> You're right. Do you want to go to class together with us? Because we're popular kids and we should hang out more often. <laughs> the truth, Ricky. <laughs> oh, hey. Excuse me, ladies. Gee, girls! <gasps> Look who it is! The annoying pick me girl! Hmm? Oh, there she! Oh my gosh, she just took Erin away like that! That's my Erin! <laughs> no, that's my Erin! How dare she? She's not unpopular! <laughs> She's just a new loser! Yeah, that's right, sisters! Looking at her makes me so mad! My blood is boiling right now! She is so low class. She's like a purple dinosaur. Hey, Ruth Bell. Hi, Erin. <laughs> Morning. So, how are you doing today? Yeah, I'm I'm good. <laughs> um, I really don't like how the three Diva sisters are staring at us like that. Ugh, they keep talking to me when they already know I have a girlfriend. Uh, a girlfriend? Uh, who? who? <laughs> it's you, silly. <laughs> <laughs> well, how was your morning, Erin? It's really great, especially when I get to see my beautiful girlfriend. Hey, why are you blushing? Um, uh, me blushing? No, I'm not blushing. You got it wrong. You're blushing. Am I? <laughs> Anyways, I gotta go to class. I'm gonna get detention if I'm late, and I don't want that to happen. Okay, um, I'm in a hurry too, so I gotta get to class before my teacher gets me in trouble. Okay, I'll see you at our lunch date. Okay, I can't wait. I'm so lucky. What does he even see in me? I'm just a nerdy little girl. I'm not even popular and I'm not a baddie like the three diva sisters. Why does someone as cool as him like someone like me? Ruth Bell? What are you doing? It's PE class right now. Should you get changed? Why are you still in uniform? Gym is about to start. Oh, right. I forgot. Oh, my gosh. Thanks, Meta. I keep forgetting what my classes were. Mm, I'll go get changed right now. emo goth twins or something? Hmm, I know they're known as the terrible twins, Teresa and Tamika, I think. Pop says, Aaron Afton is so hot. I wish I could be his girl, right? Gosh, Tamika. <sighs> There's so many hot boys in this school. Imagine all hottest boy fighting over us. Oh my gosh. <gasps> And imagine them deciding to choose between us because we're both so cool and emo and we're so twinsies. I know. Erin is like the hottest of all the boys though. I totally drool over him. Yeah, Erin is like a 10 out of 10 because obviously we cannot rate him low. <laughs> I agree with your rating. I wish he were like my husband. I would rate him a 12 if you were. <laughs> <laughs> hey, isn't that Ruth Bell? The lamest girl of all. She's like new and a loser. Yeah, are you that girl Ruth Bell? Oh, um, yeah? Nice to meet you guys. Mm. Yeah, you must know we are the terrible twins. Clarissa and Tamika. We're terribly terrific. That's why everyone calls us the terrible twins. <laughs> You better remember that, new girl. You're like the bottom of the rank. Huh? Bottom? Okay, um, nice to meet you guys. Hmm. Hey, we heard a rumor that you're dating Aaron Afton. Is that true? Tell us. Yeah, is that true? <laughs> you're so lucky. Um, 
I, I guess you can see that. I guess he's lucky to have me too. It goes both ways, I think. <laughs> We're surprised that Aaron chose such a basic girl like you. You're not his usual type, or that's what we think. To give you some context, Aaron is from a really rich family. His parents own so many businesses and are filthy rich. We assume he will be with someone that's a super duper mega rich supermodel, right? <laughs> Girl, don't you think Aaron is just playing with you? I mean, he's not even serious with you. Look at yourself, girlfriend. <laughs> Yeah, girl, people he dated in the past all come from rich families. Judging by your looks, you don't look rich at all. Do you eat garbage for morning breakfast? <laughs> oh, but I don't think he's the type to play with people's hearts for fun. Aaron is like the nicest guy I've ever met. <laughs> That's true. That's our boy, Aaron. He's a nice guy. He doesn't prefer a poor basic girl like you. Maybe he's just experimenting. But I think he loves me and he's real whenever he's with me. That's because he hasn't shown his true colors yet. Just wait. <laughs> Whatever. I hope you won't regret what we're saying because it's totally true. Not like we're jealous. Yeah, you obviously know nothing about Erin Afton. Look at the mirror first, girl. <laughs> yeah, I agree. She looks nothing like Aisha. <laughs> huh? Um, wait, uh, may I ask who's, who's Aisha? Aisha? You don't know who she is. Aisha is like the most popular hot supermodel girl in school. And I think she suits Aaron much better than you. Right? I think Aisha and Aaron will make such a beautiful, lovely couple. I guess because they're both hot, rich, and popular. Not like you, girl. What's your name again? <sighs> so hard to remember. You're low class. Girl, her name is Rotisserie Beef, if I'm not mistaken. <laughs> um, actually, my, my name is Ruth Bell. No, what's a sorry beef? Whatever, it's not important to remember your name anyway. You're gonna stay at the bottom ranks. Your parents probably have like 50 IQ or something to name yourself like that. Uh, I hope Arrow will find a better girl that suits him. Sis, let's go. Bye, loser. <laughs> Were you telling me the truth? Am I really that ugly to Aaron's eyes? I mean, if it's true, why is he still with me? I hope his feelings for me are honest. <sighs> hey, Ruthbell, don't worry. They're just jealous of you because they can't get Aaron themselves. Are you okay anyway? I bet they said something really bad to make you look kind of sad. You know, whatever they say, they're just jealous of you. These girls are desperate, you know. <sighs> Thanks, Mana. You're such a good friend. Don't worry, we're besties, right? You can rely on me for anything. Well, I guess P ended, and I, I don't have to change back to my clothes. Yeah, I guess so. Oh man, you missed PE. It's time for lunch anyway. Let me get changed and let's go get some food. Look, Ruthbell. Look, who's Aaron with? Hmm. <gasps> huh? talking to is Aisha. She's like one of the seven beauty queens in our school. Uh, what are you talking about, Dwayne? Well, I just learned recently that in OK High School, there are seven main beauty queens and they are worshipped in school. They are the seven hottest girls and each is like a supermodel, but of a different style. Oh, the three diva sisters are considered one of the seven beauty queens then? <laughs> No, the Diva Sisters wish. They're just stuck up and they think they're all that. The seven beauty queens are like seven models each with their own style. You see, Aisha is the queen of Y2K. 
She's the white to keep princess. Hmm, interesting. So every one of the seven beauty queens has like their own style? Yes! There are even styles like cottage core, cyber, garus. Pretty cool, right? <laughs> wow, thanks, Dwayne, for the information. You're pretty resourceful. Geez, you didn't have to praise me so much, big sis. <laughs> Ruth Bell, you should go talk to your man so that he doesn't get taken away. Um, okay then, you're right. I'll go right now. Okay, see you later, Aisha. <laughs> Who is this pick me girl? <laughs> hey, Ruth Bell, what's up? Wanna get lunch together now? Uh, yeah, sure. So, how's your PE class just now? Um, it's okay, I guess. Oh man, it's not that cool because the twins told me about Aaron not really liking me or something. Hmm. I should scratch that thought. Hmm. Um, did you get detention for being late, Aaron? Uh, I'm lucky that the teacher was late to class, so I didn't get detention. You okay? You look like something's on your mind. Huh? Me? Nothing's on my mind, I mean. Um, just eating. Hmm, okay. I totally believe you then. By the way, this is really good. Do you want some? Sure, why not? Hm. <laughs> um, what? What's so funny? Nothing. <laughs> oh! <laughs> you got something on your face. <laughs> Um, who, who's that, Aaron? Oh, it's just Aisha. We're working on a group assignment together for science class. We have to work, like, on a group project this week. Oh, Aisha is the Y2K queen, right? <gasps> um, what do you think of her style? Uh, Y2K? What's that? It's like a, is that like a Pokemon? I like Pikachu. Oh. <laughs> Never mind. Forget what I said. Okay, let's go back to class. I'll walk you so we can spend more time together. Okay. <laughs> hey, Dwayne, I need to stay back after school, so you have to go to your music class after school on your own today. Uh, uh, uh. I can't walk home, it'll take me an hour. Please give me a ride home. Yes, uh, my dance dead brother. No way, Dumbledore. I'm gonna go get my nails done. Go away. Oh my gosh, how can I get home then? I'm going home and I can give you a ride because you're my bestie's little brother, Dwayne. Wow, really? <laughs> Thanks, Mana. You're the best. I knew I could rely on you. Sure, you can wait outside while I get my bag first. Mm, okay, bye, guys. It's settled. I gotta go to the library to check out some history books. See you later. See ya. Okay, bye, Ruth Bell. Okay, sis. Good luck with your music class. to each other at the winter ball. Yeah, I mean, why would you remember me? A beauty queen like you gets approached by thousands of guys a day. Of course I 
remember you from the winter ball. <laughs> uh, oh, really? Wow. Yeah, of course. <laughs> <laughs> well, where are you headed to? Well, uh, I have a music class because I want to be an artist someday. Oh, that's so cool. That's so brave and that takes a lot of courage. That's such a big dream, Dwayne. Oh, yeah, it's nothing really. Well, I want to be a Bollywood actress. So maybe we can work creatively together in the music video in the future. Wow, that's a great idea. I can't wait to work with you. Me too, Dwayne. I think we're going to be that big in the future. <gasps> Dwayne, uh-oh, my limousine is here. If I'm late from school, Papa will get terribly upset. <sighs> I'll see you around, Dwayne. Bye! Yeah, I'll see you around, Priyanka. Ah, she's so breathtaking. Oh my gosh, I can't believe I talked to her. This is crazy. Come on, Dwayne, you ready to go now? You're gonna be late for music class. Oh, uh, yeah, let's go! Woohoo! Okay, let's go, Dwayne. Hold on tight. It's gonna be a speed ride. Wow, this book is so fascinating. Hmm, I really like to study theories and science and biology. I'm gonna study smarter and I can be better for Aaron. That's right. Maybe we can study together in the future. <laughs> wait, wait, oh my gosh, they're the Diva sisters from school. What are they doing in the library? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, I should go see. I don't want to get seen. Candelay, one of the hottest boys in school, Aaron, is dating such a basic pick me girl like Ruth Bell. She's not even that hot. She's at the bottom of the ranks. Ugh, she's so not hot. I agree. Oh my gosh, he should have picked me because I'm prettier than her. I can't stand looking at that pick me girl, Ruth Bell. She's so annoying. She thinks he's all that. I hate her. Her hairstyle's so ugly, too. <laughs> Ruth Bell looks like Aaron's maid whenever he's with her. Why can't she look at herself in the mirror and reflect? Maybe she can be my maid. <laughs> Maybe she can scrub my floor and clean my house and my toilet for free. Even if she does for free, I don't even want to pay her. Maybe she's too poor that she doesn't even have a mirror at home. Why did you buy a mirror for her then? Ew! No, I'm not gonna spend my money on that worthless girl. Huh, she should start crowdfunding to get a mirror from the public. But I bet no one would donate to her ever. Look at her, seriously, gross. She's so ugly! <laughs> Hothead. First of all, we don't know whether Aaron's really a player. Well, Aaron is rich, handsome, and he has six-pack abs. Almost every girl in school wants him. 
That's true, but it doesn't mean he's a player. Secondly, it doesn't look like Aaron's really interested in her. Maybe it seems like Aisha is more interested in him. And thirdly, hmm, Aaron is a purple belt in jiu-jitsu right now, and he trains MMA. Dwayne, you will be your butt all silly upside down. Uh, uh, fine, I guess you're right, but um, I'm gonna text Ruth Bell to let her know right now. Uh, why would you do that? Well, because she needs to know her boyfriend's whereabouts, duh! Hmm, right, okay. By the way, I thought you were going to your music class? No, 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 this is more important! I'll go once I text my sister, don't worry! Um, okay. Anyways, I'm off now. See you later, Dwayne. That scared me. Hmm. Oh, it's it's from Dwayne. What does he say? Sis, I saw Aaron and Aisha, the Y2K princess, at the mall food court having a meal, and they're like having really sussy conversations. Oh, uh, maybe they're discussing their science project because they're in the same group. Um, I don't think they're doing their science project here. Omg, did Aisha just share her ice cream with Aaron? Huh? You got the wrong person, maybe? I doubt they're that close. No, I'm sure it's Aaron and Aisha. Wait, let me send you a picture as proof. Okay, send it to me, quick. See, I told you. I think he might be cheating on you, sis. <gasps> hmm? Hurry up and get down here. I'm not the jealous confrontational type, though. I'm not really brave, but uh, fine, I'll come down. Okay, make it fast before they are gone. Oh my gosh, I can't believe Aaron's really with Aisha right now. I've got to go to the mall to see it for myself. Dwayne and Mana. Maybe Dwayne went to his music class and Mana has errands to run? Hmm, where are they? I don't see Aaron and Ayesha here. Hmm, just a girl eating her apple and staring at me. Um, ah, maybe I should check upstairs. Maybe Dwayne pulled a silly prank on me. I don't see him or anyone here. Hmm, Dwayne must have pulled a prank on me for sure now. This one. I'm gonna buy this one. Wow, is this for me? Wow, you have such good eyes, Aaron. Um, hello. I wanna buy this one. Excuse me. Can I get this one, please? Do you have a new one? This one is like the nicest and the most expensive, right? Yeah, sure. Of course, I'll get it right away, sir. Thanks. I'll take it. I'll take this one, the most expensive one. Ten thousand dollars. Sir. Nice to do business with you. Come again. <gasps> what? Oh my gosh. Did, did, did Aaron just buy jewelry for Aisha? I thought we were dating. How could he buy someone else something? How could he do this to me? I can't believe it. He's a cheater. <laughs> this is the worst day of my life. <laughs> oh my god. feelings again and I can't believe I let myself get fooled by him twice <laughs> I mean, I 
have such such low self-confidence and I'm not even a model nor a beauty queen like all those girls in school. I'm not I'm not fashionable like Aisha, the white to cape princess. And I'm not good at confrontation because I'm so insecure. <laughs> I'm not good enough. I'm just an ordinary girl, a loser in this high school. What, what, what does he see in me? I got cheated on and fooled by the most popular guy. Now everyone's gonna laugh at me in school. How am I gonna live like this? I hate it! <laughs> huh? Uh, uh, huh? Oh, aren't you the homeless kid in school? Oh, 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 that's right. That's me. Oh, you scared me. I was in the middle of something, but you, you totally scared me. What are you doing here? I'm hungry and you to get pizza. You want one? Uh, wait, what? Pizza? Um, is there any pizzerias nearby? Oh, my family is very poor, and sometimes we can't eat it for a few days because we don't have money. So, I have to find some food for my family in the garbage can. <laughs> oh, do you live nearby or something? No. Do you see that mountain over there? I have to walk two hours to school every day from my house, which is far away from here. It's tiring, but you know. Oh, wow, I see. Oh, that's really amazing, Bell Lord. The dedication and energy you put into school. Oh, I wish I was like that. Hmm. Hmm. You seem a little off. Is something bothering your mind? Your eyes seem puffy, you know. Oh, nothing, Bell Lord. Just boy troubles, relationship problems, you know, teenage stuff. <sighs> you don't happen to have any advice for me, maybe? Well, I'll tell you this. <clears throat> if two hearts are meant to be together, no matter how tough it seems, fate will find its way to bring them together to share their love forever. That's all I have to say. You can interpret it any way you want. <gasps> wow. Hmm. That is really deep, Bell Lord. You have such wise words. Thank you. No, I must go home for dinner. Hmm, I gotta walk all the way home. My family is currently waiting for me. Wait, do you really need to eat that garbage pizza? It's not very healthy. I have no choice. This is the only way for me and my family to survive. <gasps> How about this? Take some of my pocket money. Here's some cash for you. Buy some good food for your family to eat. And this is my only way to repay you for your kindness and good wisdom. Oh, wow. Thank you so much, Ruth Bell. You saved my family's dinner. Oh, I'm eternally grateful. My dad's gonna eat some good garbage ice cream tonight. <laughs> oh, he's gonna go buy some garbage ice cream for his dad with my money when I gave him like a hundred bucks? Ugh, I guess whatever makes him happy. Hmm. <sighs> Oh, okay, I've decided I'm gonna confront Aaron tomorrow. <sighs> I'm scared. I've decided I'm gonna do that, but I've never confronted anyone before, and I don't know what it takes. Mm, I'll do what it takes and be a strong girl. A brave, strong girl. To be honest, I'm not okay. I saw Aaron cheating on me. I'm gonna confront him today. I saw him with Aisha at the jewelry store buying stuff for him. How can he do this to me, Mana? I told you over the phone, right? <sighs> but I lack confidence and inner strength. Chris Bell, you got this, girl. Come on, go be the girl boss you can be. 
You can definitely do it. You're strong and brave, and you're super courageous. Trust in yourself. <gasps> Mana, I wish I were as cool and strong as you. You're so confident. You are. You just don't know it. Thanks, Mana. You're my best friend. I don't know what I'm gonna do without you. <sighs> oh, wait a second. Hmm? <gasps> Isn't that Dwayne over there? What is he, who is she talking to? Um, who's that girl is with? <laughs> oh, wait a second. Is that preppy princess Priyanka? I've heard of her in school. She's really popular. <gasps> wait a minute. Is she one of the seven beauty queens? You mean she's the preppy princess, right? Like I Aisha is a Y2K princess? Something like that on top of the school rankings? Hmm, I guess so. I don't really know. Don't forget, I'm a newbie here too. Oh right, I forgot. Hmm, wait a second. I'm a newbie too. Well, we're not princesses or queens, but that makes us newbie queens, right, I guess? Hmm, I guess so. Hmm... Wait a second, we still have no idea who the other five beauty queens are. I wonder who they are. Hmm. Yeah, I wonder who they are. Hmm. Just like a ranking in the school, but um. <laughs> <laughs> wow, I didn't know that he knew Priyanka. She's like an aspiring Bollywood actress and she's so drop dead gorgeous. Wow, she's beautiful. Look at how soft she looks. Mm, yeah, I didn't know that either. Hmm, she's actually really pretty in person. Wow, I've only heard about her from my friends and online. Well, anyways, Mana, thanks for everything. I gotta go confront Erin now. <gasps> Wish me strength and luck. You can do it, girl. Don't be scared. Manifest it. Go ahead, I believe in you. Okay. I got this. I'm so nervous. Anyways, this is pretty good for lunch. Hey, Belly. Sorry I'm late for a lunch date. I had to do my presentation for my science project just now, and I also had to clean up. Oh, um, it, it, it's okay, Aaron. Um, um, actually, there has been many things on my mind lately, Aaron. I bet you have no idea a lot of girls like you. Uh, I gotta tell you something. Hmm, I'm not sure if I'm as pretty or special as these model girls that hit on you, you know? Um, I do have something to say and I'm gonna just say it out loud. <clears throat> I'm gonna stand up for myself and I'm not gonna be insecure. And if this is meant to work, we have to be completely open and communicate with each other clearly. So, uh, I'm gonna say what's on my mind. We have to be honest with each other, Aaron. You you hear me? Mm, do you feel the same? Oh uh, yeah, sure. I totally agree. I mean, that's how relationships work, right? Uh, whoa, they that came out of nowhere. Are you okay today? Uh, uh yeah. Oh, oh, fine. I finally said it. Oh, phew. Okay, nice. Um, it's really reassuring that you you, you agree with me. I guess. Anyways, I just finished my science project presentation. And guess what? I got an A. Oh my gosh, really? <gasps> I'm so proud of you! You're such a smart person! You're my smart boyfriend. I would have given you a gift. <laughs> Good job, Erin! What? Really? Are you really that proud of me? Of course I am! I thought you wanted to say something. So what's on your mind? Oh, oh okay, okay. I totally forgot. Um, um okay, fine. Um, this, okay, I'm just gonna spill it out, okay? <sighs> Dwayne actually told me that he saw you and Aisha hanging out at the mall yesterday after school. And... Um, I, I thought you might be cheating on me because I saw you both in the jewelry store. Oh, that? I was actually working on the science project with Aisha last evening after school. And then when we finished our science project, I just went to the jewelry store to buy something. But Aisha wouldn't leave me alone. She basically just stalked me and followed me all the way there. <sighs> She's pretty annoying. Oh, okay. But why was she there too? I don't know. She just keep following me even though I told her that I already have a girlfriend. Doesn't seem like she cared at all. Hmm. Maybe you should tell her you're not interested and tell her straight up to get away. Huh. <sighs> all these girls chasing you. <laughs> Are you jealous, babe? So cute. No, I'm not 
much. No, I'm not jealous. I'm not jealous at all. Hmm. I just don't really like it when a lot of girls give you attention. Besides me. Oh, really? You're not jealous at all? <laughs> Someone's jealous and someone's blushing. So cute. I'm not blushing. Uh, that's just my blusher, okay? My blush powder. Mm, okay, what an instant blush powder that suddenly blushes. Cool, got it. So, wh what were you doing in the jewelry store? Hmm? Are you buying something for her or someone? Well, I want to get a gift for you to celebrate our one month anniversary. Look at you being all jealous. <gasps> Wait, for, for me? Yeah, we'll never hurt each other anymore after this, okay? It's a promise ring. Here. <gasps> you can open it later, and you'll see what it looks like. But okay. I'm telling you, this is a promise ring for you and me. Okay, promise. I promise I'll never hurt you no matter what. By the way, I spent my entire allowance on this. It's like $10,000. <gasps> what? Wait, wait, your monthly allowance is $10,000? Oh my gosh, that's so much. <gasps> That's crazy! Oh, yeah, I forgot. Your family is like super duper rich, right? Well, it's our one month anniversary, so I think it's time. I want to introduce you to my mother over dinner this Friday. What do you think? Huh? Wait, you 